So today I think I'm gonna start tackling some of the rust on the car. And by I, I mean a friend of mine. I'm actually going over to his house today. He's gonna help me start fixing this god awful quarter panel. I don't even wanna show it to you guys right now, but I'm, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. This is just the worst. I didn't realize that basically this whole thing was bondoed prior to me owning the car. I thought that it was actually still the original quarter. Um, this right here, you can look, that's that's not, that's clearly not metal, that's Bondo right there. And that's the whole, the whole quarter. So we're gonna cut this whole thing and just hopefully re-weld the uh, new Subi Savers panel on today. Completely forgot to mention that I finally installed the access for it. Uh, everything looks pretty healthy, except uh, the dam right now was a little bit low. Honestly, I think that's just because I've been using a different gas station, so I'm gonna go back to using strictly only Shell, and hopefully it should go back up to 16. Basically, so for the dam, for the old GD models, you want it to be at 16. Uh, for the FA motors or 2015 up, I guess it's supposed to be like one. If it drops below that, it means that, like, there's something going on, so. Here, it's 3-4 a gallon. Where in my hometown, like where I live, it's 3-5. Other places it's been like 3-2. Let me know what you guys pay for gas. Nice. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, Literally, the, mo the moment I put the zip tie on, I hit one bump and I went Yeah, I bet. Yep, we're gonna have to... I'm gonna beat on that, but... Because of that? Yeah, well, yeah. Got the next. Do you wanna? It'll fit a little bit better when we cut all the shit out. Alright. Good started then, I guess. Yeah. The reason that took so long is because I was looking for an impact gun that whole time. Couldn't find one, so I just broke them by hand, had to put it back on the floor. Um, got the wheel off, we're gonna take this fuel door off, and then we're gonna start welding, so back to the time lapse. Alright, so everything's off, um, everything's out of the way, we're gonna, we're gonna start cutting now. I'm like scared. What? Why are you scared? You've done this before. <laughs> Once. <laughs> Once. All right. <laughs> so, like I said before, most of this is bondo. We're gonna cut from. I don't know if you guys can see the line here. Go through. Yes, I'm definitely gonna take that. <laughs> I don't really know much about what's gonna be happening today. I'm kind of just here to watch and learn and kind of just help out because you know it is my car, so I wasn't gonna make him do all the work. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoy the process and back to the time lapse. Yeah, that, that it's right the, there uh, is bad. It's the cone they use for it. What is it? It's, that's what's all in the wheel. Oh! It's like a rubber spongy. Dude, this was bad. This whole thing was cracked. I think I didn't go any more on this. How come? Oh. It's getting close. Really? This would be easy. Well, holy shit. This would be mint. Let's see right there, though. I haven't even used this one yet. I think it's really fun. Just, I'm, I'm sorry. I just think it's really funny that they sent me this and it says that it's for the GG. The GG is the wagon. So originally when I got this, I literally looked at them and I was like, I ordered the GD one. <laughs> but then I put it on the car and I was like, oh, it fits like perfectly. I, so I'm assuming that these are all just like universally labeled. <laughs> yeah, the Ford, uh, the Escape was. That's the same thing with with yours too. Yeah. How much did the panel cost? Uh, I want to say like two hundred dollars. Yeah, mine was about the same to be honest. So, cutting out that 
when they're over there just because on the actual the on the Super Savers quarter panel it's a little bit higher than where the actual frame of the car sits so we're gonna have to cut a little bit off of that to make it fit flush and perfect but so far I mean he's been doing most of the cutting but so far it's going really really good I think cutting out everything that needs to get cut and sanding down and everything that needs to get sanded. Um, these are all the old pieces. Gross. Junk. Um, we're going to start welding that or he's going to start welding it now. Thanks guys! <laughs> Give me a 180. I'm getting You're only 20, 20 bro. 21. I need more speed. A little bit, a little bit. Yeah! Oh, <laughs> into the trash can! See what I mean by uh, rear tire flex? Them spokes are not fucking tight no more. Yeah, see? You hear them? They're not tight. Did you ever hear the story about me blowing the uh, headset out on that in Boston? Oh. It's coming out of the bowl, I landed rough and the like, headset snapped. My headset snapped. Like in half, dude. Oh. Oh. You're forgetting to turn the wheel. You lift my spirits when you hold my hand. Anywhere we land, it's like our toes are in the sand. You got my feelings set to overload Spilling over more Until I guys look this is a just a, you know a little bit that we got to fill um, or pull it out or something just to make sure that the body lines match up okay but right now it's pretty mint the welds are good the welds are fucking phenomenal actually and it's on there so yeah thanks for watching today's video I, I really hope you guys enjoyed it or you know found some some sort of knowledge or something in it peace out and uh, keep moving forward